Let's make easy peanut butter bars. Let's go. First of all, what you need to do is you take one cup of sugar, one cup of peanut butter, and one cup light corn syrup and heat it up in a pan and keep stirring. Okay, this is what the peanut butter goodness looks like. And then next, I am pouring this into six cups of Rice Krispies. So remember, one cup peanut butter, one cup light corn syrup, and one cup sugar all mixed in. And then you mix it in with the Rice Krispies. And I've made these before, but it has been a long time. So sometimes I really enjoy baking. The good thing with this is this makes quite a bit. And what else is that, you know, since it bakes a lot, last time I made it, what I did is I went ahead and I took cut up a bunch of pieces. Then I also, after that, I put a bunch in the freezer, little bite-sized pieces. So it makes it nice so that you can freeze a bunch for later. I'll be back to show you what it looks like. Next, what you do is you take one package of semi-sweet or milk chocolate, anything you want, and you heat it up in a pan over the stove. Now, this is what the mixture looks like. It's the peanut butter mixture, which is six cups of some kind of rice crisp cereal. And then on the stove, you heat one cup of peanut butter, one cup of light corn syrup, and one cup of sugar. You mix it up. Then you mix it with these six cups. You press it down in here. Then on the side now, what I'm going to do next, and I'll show you what it looks like when it's done, I'm going to heat this package up over the stove. I'd rather do it that way than in the microwave. I just prefer to do it that way. That way I make sure I don't burn it, and I'm going to be watching it the whole time. And heat that up and melt all of it. And then I'm going to spread it over this, and then I'll refrigerate. I'll be back in a minute. This is what the melted chocolate looks like. I would love to take a bite, but it has to go on top of this deliciousness. And it is going to be super good. Wait, i got to turn off the oven first. That's always a good thing to do when not in use. Anyway, I'm going to spread this over the cake. I wish I could tilt this camera down here so you guys could see. I'm still practicing with my cell phone to see if I can get it to uh, film me, which I am doing with that, but I'm not sure how to get it to turn all the way down where you can actually see what I'm doing. So anyway, I'm going to spread this out. I'm going to show you what it looks like, and then I'm going to refrigerate it. Thanks, guys. Okay, all this is what it looks like. I haven't refrigerated yet because it says I do need to chill it for several hours, so I'll be back later tonight to show you the final result. Bye. Okay, guys, so just really quick, this is what the peanut butter looks like, or peanut butter bar. It has the chocolate and the Rice Krispies underneath it. Uh, it, it makes a whole great big amount, and I'm going to freeze a lot of this in the freezer. It's, it is tasty. I tasted some. It would melt kind of quick in your hand, though, so you, it, but this would make a great little freezer treat. Cut them up, put them in the freezer, individualize them. It could make a good treat, or if you bring it to, say, a picnic or a potluck, and it's super easy to throw together. Okay, guys, let me know what some of your favorite little desserts are that you might have every now and then or that you may bring to a social gathering. I'd like to hear from you in the comments below. That's all for now. I love you, appreciate you, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.